Hello everybody, I'm in the Littlewood, also known as Martin, and welcome to the final prison inside of the Escapist 2. For now, hopefully they're going to do some more DLC. Obviously we've already done uh, the Glorious Regime, which is the first DLC prison, so I'd be very inclined to think that there will be more in the future. But this, everybody, is the USS Anomaly. So, the description reads the following. In the not-too-distant future, an overpaid think tank of pioneers came up with the air-brained notion of cons in space. Here we find cosmos adjusted criminals shipped to secure interstellar uh, stations designed to solve problems of Earth's overcrowded prisons. This sounds mad. We are literally going into space. I kind of want to stick with the Guardians theme that we had in the last episode. Seeing as this is the last prism, I'm going to try my hardest to keep randomizing and see if we can find Martin 2.0. If not, we'll make him, but it'd just be nice if he was actually called Martin Littlewood, wouldn't it? Oh, that's close. It's a guy called Pat. That's about as close as we're going to get. Let me very quickly adjust this guy. So if I just throw on uh, my special headband, where is it? There it is, just for me. That pretty much looks like me. I don't think the face is quite that chubby, even though I'm getting a bit fat. Uh, there you go. Nice little slim face instead. So that is going to be Martin. Oh, Martin 2.0. Boom, there we go. Right, time to remake all of these prisoners. So you can be uh, Gamora. Nice. You can be Groot, seeing as you've got the uh, green glasses on, all planty-like. Uh, you can be uh, Drax. We're going to have Drax in this one. Uh, we can have this guy over here be Star-Lord. Let's go ahead and have this guy be, uh, what's his name, Yondu. Let's have Nebula in here as well. Let's have a look. Uh, actually, Nebula can be this one right here. Nebula. And then I guess this final guy here can be Rocket. So we've got all the Guardians, Yondu, and Nebula. I like that. And also Martin 2.0. Let's get into it. We've got... Oh, I didn't change the officer names to Brindley and Lane. That's fine. That's okay. They're all weird, cyborg-y looking things anyway. Let's see what this prison holds for us. I'm nervous about this one. This one is probably going to be unlike anything we've ever played before. Approach, convict! After 70 years in cryosleep to reach this prison, you may now begin your 12-month sentence. <laughs> that makes no sense. All inmates are required to attend roll call. Okay. That's a long time to travel for such a short sentence. Various nutrients are dispensed here. Initiating taste test. Zero out of ten. God. Visit the infirmary if your mortal body is damaged. Can we get a hot tub installed? <laughs> I'm not liking this sow thing. Is that going to be like a new security camera? Oh, no, the regular security cameras are there. Increase your operating capacity with the gym equipment. What's he doing? Oh, he's like gearing the machine up whilst he's trying to like ride it. He's speeding it up even. These machines will assign you a job, inmate. That's kind of cool. Get to spend a little bit of time on the computer every day. In the event of an emergency, please use the provided escape pods once they are operational. Right, so our job is going to be to fix them. I get it. I get it. Right, welcome to Space Prison, everybody. An unidentified skull. Tub of bleach is a good start. To uh, to uh, toothpaste. Toothbrush, even. And a roll of toilet paper as well. Good stuff. We got a quest from Drax immediately. And roll call is done right in the center. There are contraband scanners everywhere. Literally everywhere. How is this going to play out? Oh, my word. So many quests to be had. I'm just going to grab them all. Just immediately giving me a fake vent cover. So that's not good. How am I going to get rid of that? Where is it? Discredit. Place it in Martin 2.0's desk. This isn't going to work. This, I, can't, I can't do it. I'm going to get caught immediately. Where's Martin 2.0's desk? Mizzy's desk. Martin 2.0's desk. Maybe when everybody's gone, I can place it really, really quick. Like really quick. Martin 2.0 is already red compared to us. Actually, I think all the inmates are. Oh, no, actually, maybe not. Hmm, okay. Can I accept any more quests right now? Go on, then. There you go. Tin of paint for Yondu. Of course, he's a gentle soul. He acts like he's all tough and hard, but he's really not. Right, let's see if we can do this one, then. Where is it? Um, discredit. It's 25 gold, so it's a really nice start to have. Okay, you ready for this? Ooh, I'm going to wait for the guards to get really out of the screen. I like the music. And there we go. It's all gone off. Go on, go on, go on. Place it, place it, place it. Gotcha. Okay. So they only go to the detector itself, which is interesting. Huh. Never knew that. I've got no contraband on me right now. Wait, wait. Whoa. Hold on a second. I thought I had lots more stuff in my hotbar. No, I didn't actually. No, that's a lie. That's a lie. 
Let me just run across this way. Oh, my God. Yeah, I'm going to get hit on the way in there. There you go. At least I've shown my face, though. Let's grab a quick quest off for of you. Nope, that's not happening. <laughs> Let's have a little look at this map. I love this little eco bit on the left side, by the way. I want to go see what the gardens are like. Oh, it's part of a, a farming job. Oh, I so want the farming job, dude. Oh, this one's really strange to look at. So where are those escape pods? That's what I want to find out first and foremost. And I guess also the telephone as well. Hey, phones are just above us a little bit. Do we have 50 bucks? We don't. If we can do a little bit of questing this morning, we can get straight to the payphone and figure out how to get out of here. 75 bucks to make a weapon. Problem is, though, can we knock out the person inside of these quarters? That's the big question right now. Let's have a little look here. I love his little spacesuit. He looks so cute. All right, let's see what we've got. Uh, that is going to be checking us like crazy. Constantly, constantly checking us. Get out, get out, get out. There was... Oh, dude. Nope, nope, we've lost it. There was wire and there was some other stuff. Is that our desk just there? It is, it is, it is. And boom. Got it. <sighs> this is going to be a lot of knockouts, isn't it? There was wire and chocolate in there. Those would both be really good for us inside of this prism. We're going to have to try and get on it with a contraband pouch. But again, instantly, duct tape and roller foil are both going to be uh, bad items for us. This is going to take some going. Or we're going to have to be using a lot of... Uh, <laughs> not putty, what's it called? Paper mache to cover over the cameras. Oh, look at this. You're taking me to job period, pretty much. I mean, it's close enough. Look at the satellites as well. They're cool. Right, here we go then. Oh, there's a little locker just through there. Or a little uh, desk even. Let's have a little look what's inside of that. Anything good? Paper clip. Actually, there you go. There's a water putty right there. That's a good start. Right, upstairs from there then, we have got a locked off area. And that seems to be about your lot. I still don't fully understand how to open those doors. Like, is it a case of I need to, like, turn off a generator to open them, or is it something else? I have no idea. I'm just going to keep running around and just sort of explore a little bit, get a lay of the land. What's up here? So this is just a random space deck. Is this the shower, do you reckon? Do you reckon they do weird space showers? You know, like in Guardians, they, like, spray them with that weird orange stuff. <clears throat> that makes them all, like... I would guess the skin looks inflamed afterwards, doesn't it? It doesn't look comfy. Uh, where is job period? Oh, it's up the doorway. It's up the stairs. Let's have a little look at it. Where is it? Uh, oh, God, another detector. They are literally everywhere, aren't they? This is madness. Oh, I see. There we go. There's the job room. Uh, should we do it to get ourselves a couple quid? Yeah, let's do it. Let's sit down. Some interesting developments. Who do you think you are? Well, just me. Maybe one day you could be in my place. Without a job, you're nothing. All done? All done shouting at me? Okay, thanks, bud. I don't know if I'm getting 10 gold immediately from doing that. How much have we got? 35 bucks. It's going to be a bit, isn't it? Race from space. Peas in a pod. Oh, that's the multiplayer one. Oh, that's a shame. An energy sword. Whoa, hold on a second, dude. Oh, when he said energy sword, I was thinking of like a Halo one. You know what I mean? <laughs> I was thinking of like Arby sword. Oh, that'd be cool if we could get one of those. Right, where are we right now? Dining hall. Clone is right there. There is a little desk just here. Let me see if there's anything good inside of this thing. Hopefully there's something good. Bend the knee. <laughs> Lighter and also a tube of paints. Not bad, not bad. Let's go through here. Have a little look in the garden. I'll set my dogs on you. Get lost, mate. Get lost. So that's the same job that we had inside of... What was the prison? It would have been... I think that was Kapow Camp, actually, where we had that gardening job. Or we make all the little potted plants. Uh, we still do need to try and do this quest, don't we? Of getting the various different pieces of the beat the bully. This is going to take some going. So if I quickly just drop some stuff inside of this desk. What we got? One, two, three, four. So we're going to try and grab a thing and run it straight through to the other side. Those cameras move so fast, dude. Right, where are the officers? I need to wait for a clearing so I can get in there, get an item and run all the way back to there. It's going to be tricky. It's almost the end of the day already. Can't believe that. This day goes through fast. Come on. Officer, what's that? Key Aston. Oh, they've all got weird, like, <laughs> text-to-speech names. Or, like, uh, leet speech names. Look, Officer Picks, YZX63. That's awesome. Officer Aston, Officer Lockhart, D2. That's good. I like that. G3PO. That's a nice one. I'm digging that. Right, as soon as that guard is far enough away. Probably, oh, no, because now there's another guard right there. Sod it. I'm just going to go for it. 
Camera's gonna spot me. That'll be fine. Just grab the item and run and then go like so. Whoa, hold on a second. Oh, he didn't have it. He didn't, he didn't spot me. That's good. So if I get out of the room quick enough, they won't realize it was me. That's really, really good. Okay, cool. So we've got one more to get. So if I was to go like so. There you go. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, no, he's going to spot me that time for sure. For sure, for sure, for sure. Grab the duct tape. Get out of there. But then the detector's going to go off. Another detector's gone off. But I've got enough to get that inside of there. Whew. Good. All right, we're fine. Uh, exercise period. Exercise period is miles away. I'm about to get knocked out. Um, I don't know. I'll tell you what. I'll run towards it. I know exercise period is relatively close to the infirmary, but it's all right. You know what? I just thought, if it's already 9 p.m., do you reckon that the day just starts a hell of a lot later? Because in space, it's always dark. So you don't have to worry about the sun and cycle and everything like that. There we go. I've shown me face. Should we give these guys the runaround for a little bit? Let's see if we can actually lose them. Okay, no, I'm dead. <laughs> I was like, let's see if we can get past them. Nobody will have to know. It'll be fine. Uh, right, so the beat the bully job wants us to knock out Star-Lord. Right, okay. So we're going to have to knock out old Peter Quill with the baseball bat that we're about to put together. I think it was a baseball bat. Tell you what would be really handy in here if we got ourselves a tub of bleach. We could loot all of these desks without the cameras going off at us if we just had a bit of bleach. I'm trying to remember where we found some bleach before. One of these two desks had bleach in it, 100%. Which one was it? Oh, it was that one there. Go, 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 go. Cool, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Right, uh, lunchtime. Let's get ourselves in there. Yeah, I think that's going to be the best way to go about this. Is always be in an infirmary outfit. You're never going to be in trouble. It's going to be grand. Uh, let me just stand out of the way so they don't tell me off for not wearing any clothes right now. So, one, two. Oh, I can't do that right now. My intellect isn't high enough. Where is the library then? Where is it? Library. Oh, it's on this floor, actually. Cool, we've already shown our face, so let's get ourselves over to it. I was about to charge run them, but I don't think that's going to be the best idea in the world. See what we got. Where is it? Uh, just here. Some bongos. Oh, there's some books in the corner. So even, uh, I guess maybe it's like a little homage to home. Where we've travelled so far away from Earth to come here for prison sentences. Yet we're still reading regular old books. I guess it's got a nice authentic human feel to it, hasn't it? Rather than it feeling too digital. I don't know what level you have to be to make the uh, the outfit. It could well be like in the 40s or 50s. Maybe even higher. Should I have a quick look? Where is it? Crafting... Where is it? Oh, it is. It's 50. Okay. Let me show my face at roll call, and then we'll come back here. Do you reckon that's going to be evening roll call? No. No, it can't be. It surely can't be. There we go. No one on Earth likes you. That's why you're here. All right. Whatever you say, bro. Let's accept a couple more quests. Nope. Full, uh, maxed out on the quest now. Okay. Right. Grab these three items then. Let's make the old baseball bat. Oh, no, we can't. Yeah, no, we can't make it. It's a whip as well that we're making. Just realized the ingredients for it. Uh, shakedown for today is... Who's it going to be? Who's it going to be? Groot and Nebula. Okay. Hopefully this isn't bedtime. Really hope it's not bedtime. Be kind of dumb if it was. No, yet free time. Okay, cool. We are being dirty little stopouts. We're staying up well late, everybody. Way past our bedtime. I'm excited about this. I'm very quickly getting used to the layout of this prison as well. Like, almost immediately, I knew the way to get back to, um, back to this room straight away. Don't know if we checked this desk in the library just yet. Let me have a quick look. Uh, we definitely did not. There's some really good stuff in there. Cool. Uh, I would take all of those. It does mean we're going to have to go through a detector before getting back to our room. So it's going to be a bit of a mish to get in there. And if we had to drop items in, I would say we would drop the duct tape. And I guess we'd drop the metal sheet as well in there. The nails, I'm like not too bothered about just yet. I don't think they're going to be overly important towards any of these recipes. Uh, let's see. Let me sit down for a couple minutes. What period are we going into then? Job time. Oh, okay, cool. Perfect. Job time is literally right here. Boop. Show me face. Back on out again. Should hopefully... Actually, am I going to have enough? I'm only on 42 at the minute. I need 50 in order to make these bits. I don't think it's going to be enough, but we'll just keep sitting in a regular um, seat and go from there. It's a shame that we're not closer to the um, to the dining hall. Oh, yeah. What are the dogs inside of this prison? I can see the dog icon on the minimap just there, but I don't see any regular old poochies. Are they like little digitized ones? Oh, yeah, look at that. <laughs> oh, oh, he's, oh, you've detected contraband on me. Oh, no. You little snitch. So if you actually go near them on this floor, they do sniff you out. That's not good. There we go. Drop those two into there. Let me sit on a chair for a moment. I can consult my list again. So, yeah, we were up to 47. So I need a little bit more, and then we can get that infirmary outfit made. Although, if thinking about it, how much would we need to get the whip? The whip would be 60. Right. Okay. 
So maybe we'll worry about the whip quest later on. We've got the, the components for it. Or we can try and do it today. I don't know. I don't know. The problem is I don't know how long's left on the day. It's not a normal day-night cycle, is it? Oh, the guard's going to knock me out just as I got to 50. That's a douchey move. All right, let's see if we can find ourselves a locker anywhere. We still need to try and get that money as well so we can look at the uh, the quest out. Oh, there are two lockers in there, but I couldn't get either of them. Nope, that's going to require the sign key. I can go inside this room, I guess. Oh, there's a grate in the floor there. Where would you lead to, friend? So if you were to go through the floor to floor number or vent number one. Oh, whoa. Okay, hold on a second. This is quite an elaborate space. I like it. So where, where would that lead you to? So if you were to go over to here and get out in that room, or f floor one, I guess. Ah, oh, that puts you inside the infirmary. Still don't know what you'd stand to gain from doing that, but never mind. Right, let's have a look then. Uh, beat the bully, we can't do just yet. P45, we don't want to do just yet. Tin of paint for Yondu. That should give us the rest of the money, right? Yeah, yeah, easy. Let's do that one then. Let's have a look. Uh, quest, tin of paint for Yondu. It's going to be inside of somebody's desk. Tell you what, if I make that infirmary outfit now as well, we might be good. Uh, let me just stand out of the way, out of line of sight of everybody. And I can quickly throw it together and put it on. Yeah, no one here. Oh, no, that guard's coming after me. Of course he is. Uh, what's inside of that desk? I don't think he would tell me off for searching this desk, seeing as it doesn't belong to anybody. There's a lighter, a file, and some nails. Okay. Right, let me throw this off. Where is it? One, two, craft. And then throw that bad boy on. Now, hopefully, we're not going to get shouted at. Obviously, unless we go through a scanner with an item. Uh, let's see. Nothing else to find in that infirmary. There's no extra, like, door out of it. There's no, like, bonus room with an extra chest in it. Right, here we go then. It's the real test. The true test. Can we raid this desk without getting spotted by the camera? It would appear so. It would appear so. That's awesome. Okay, cool. Uh, and also what I've just realized is coming in from this side of the cells means that you can get to the cells from the outside. So even if I've got some contraband there, I don't have to run it through the middle. I can actually run back around. Never even thought about looking at that before. So that's really, really good to know. Oh, we do have contraband on us here, though. Maybe we try and run that to our desk first or something. And then take it back. Or can we go through that way? Oh, no, we still got to go through it. Tell you what, let me just drop it here real quick. I reckon we can do this real quick. I reckon we can leg it in here. Give the item to Yondu. There you go. Uh, I'm going to grab that one for you. Anything else? So now I've got a wall block. That's not good, because that's contraband, isn't it? Oh, he spotted it. I'll take it. <laughs> Stole it before he could get rid of it. That's nice. Uh, let's go and drop that contraband in our desk then. And we can figure out the rest from here. So let's quickly put that into our room. So uh, that one can go into there. We don't have high enough level, do we, for this? Tri triple check. No, yeah, not yet. Okay, cool. That's fine. One, two, three. Okay, we can go inside of this room. Quickly drop the wall block in there. Another quest done. Then we'll get ourselves to the payphone as well. Uh, oh, nice. Another tub of bleach. That'll be handy for the future. As well as another file. This credit is finished. Okay, this isn't going to be as difficult as I thought then. I was really worried about this prison. But I think for now, everything's pretty cushy. Um, I'm going to drop that into my desk. And I'm going to drop the skull outside. Because I really don't see it being useful. So drop that one just there. Oh, God, it's shower period. Okay, hold on. I need to try and get to shower period ASAP. Go, 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 go. God, it's almost 6 a.m. This is a really weird time of day to wake up, isn't it? It's going to mess me up when we get back to Earth. I'm not going to know what which way is up and what time is what. Where's the shower period? Is it above the medic ward? Oh, yeah, so it is. I'm going to get shouted out for being late, but then we're fine. Good job. Right, so I'm guessing maybe 6 a.m. is the evening roll call. Before we go, let's go for Race from Space. Ready? For years, mankind has wanted to conquer space, but not like this. I know the whereabouts of the gravity control to give you the upper hand and try to bust loose. To get to the gravity control, you'd have to head to the warden's office. Then with that sorted, I'd use something thrust powered, like a jetpack. Maybe you could get your hands on one from the guards quarter situation east of the prison. Right, okay, so we gotta get a jetpack from the east, from the guards place, and then we have to go to the warden's office. All of that seems relatively doable. I think we can pull that out of the bag pretty easily. All we'd need is a red key, I guess, to be able to get ourselves in there. Uh, what you got, Gamora? You're not going to give me a weird item, are you? No, you just want me to beat a rocket. That's not very nice. Oh, God. Hold on a minute. That was my bad. <laughs> I misclicked. I completely misclicked. Sorry. Sorry. So where's the guards' quarters, then? So that's over here. Do we have it as a quest at all? I guess we wouldn't, would we? So we've got the, the, the guards' quarters here. That's the guard room. And then that's the actual control room. Okay. And then what? where did he say the warden's office was? Where was it? 
can't remember where you said the warden's office was. Is it on the floor above? Oh wow, that wasn't the that wasn't the bedtime roll call. That was still only free time. That's mad. Yeah, let me read this again. So where was it? Um, to get to the gravity controls, go to the warden's office. Then with that sorted, yeah. But where's the warden's office? Do we know? Let's have a look at this map. Mining job, infirmary, gym, showers, infirmary again. Warden's office, right? It's over there. Okay, hold on. Can we even get in there initially? Oh no, we need a couple of red keys in order to get in there. One. Then the detector, two, and then we'd be in there. And then just over there is where the officers are. I kind of want to have a little look at that before we have to get back into bed. Although I'm not sure I'm going to get back to my cell in time to inspect that. No, we're not. <laughs> There's no chance. I'm barely going to get back to my bed as it is. So, I guess that's it for our first night. Is that a hole in the floor? What is that? It's that weird hole in the floor. We have a toilet. We don't need to poop in a hole, do we? <laughs> I don't understand what it is. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, everybody. In the next episode, we will try and have a, a go at getting ourselves a red key, getting the pieces in place for that, and then we'll figure out the rest as we go. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Ta-ra.